Hello everyone, today I'm going to be posting a different type of video, it's more of a tutorial. Uh, so I know I've posted a lot of script content, and a lot of people are asking, how do I use these scripts? And the simple answer is, you need an executor. And since a lot of people don't have money, and I don't either, <laughs> uh, I use a free executor. And some people are looking for some free executors, and if you're looking for a paid one, it's simple as Synapse X. It's the best executor on the market, everyone wants to use it, it's very good. Better than everything. Um, for free, personally, I think Kernel is the best. Uh, some people say JJ Sploit. Some people say Electron because it was the first to get unpatched. But I think it's Kernel. Kernel is very simple to use, but it is very key intensive, which means that you're going to need a key every 24 hours. So it's kind of annoying. But it's worth it. So I'll be showing you guys how to get that. So from Google, you're just going to want to open up your tab. I was just doing a Roblox video, but you're going to want to go into a new tab. You're going to want, want to type kernel, so K-R-N-L dot C-A. I'll also have this linked in description because some people, you know, don't want to click on the wrong thing. So I understand that. Um, just to prove, I'll go into my files. We'll go downloads. I have nothing. I got some YouTube shit, some videos, some MSI Afterburner. Nothing here that is kernel. We can actually type K-R K-R-N-L. Nothing except my YBA shit, which was just, um... A script. I'll actually make a video on that as well. But. So, as you can see, no kernel. We're going to go straight up. Never use the word. You're always going to want to use this. I don't know if it works on Mac, by the way. Uh, so, you're going to click download. It's going to run this kernel underscore console underscore bootstrapper dot exe. You're going to want to not discard this. You have to have your antivirus turned off. So, I'm going to go update in security, Windows security, open Windows security, Virus and threat protection, manage settings, real time protection. You're going to want to turn that off. Once it's turned off, you can close everything here. You're going to want to ignore that notification and you're going to want to go to downloads. Or no, uh, yeah, yeah, downloads. Keep dangerous file. And I understand it says dangerous file, and I'm going to completely be honest with you, it is not. It just says that, makes sense, but it's not. And I will be proving it. So you're going to want to keep dangerous file, keep anyway. Now you're going to show it in the folder. As you can see, I just downloaded it. From here, you will just double click it. It'll run it. It's going to download the kernel application, run the updates. So every week, there's a Roblox update. You're also going to have to update kernel. Everything is all done. Everything's up to date. You can run kernel fine now. Click any key, S, it's done. I can close this. It's going to automatically open this. This is what you want. Nothing can of this can be gone. You're going to see this kernel SS. Double click that. That opens the app. Now you got your scripts. I already have a ton of, uh, ton of scripts from my old folders. So if I open my file, as you can see, I have a ton of scripts. I've already done all this stuff. But there are things that you, know, you can't do. So let's go from here. Uh, we're going to close this. We're going to open this. Close that. And we're going to start with the tutorial on how to use it. So, you're going to want, let's do, oh, the Funky Friday script. Because some people are complaining about it anyway. I'll show you that it still works. I'm in a game now. There are many buttons here. And I understand that might be confusing. You only are going to need inject, open file, save file, execute, and clear. Nothing out of this. Also, you're going to need get key. Nothing here you want to use. Don't use hot scripts. Don't use games. You don't, like, yeah, you don't need that. First thing, inject. <coughs> inject. If sometimes you need a key, you're going to click get key. It's going to bring you to this. It's a link for ties. I don't need this, but it's going to get you through five different things. I know it's annoying, but you have to do it to get your key. It's going to ask for a key. You're going to paste that in and you're going to click enter and boom, you're in. There we are. We do not need anything else from here. Now, once you're here, you're going to you know walk in your game. You know you're in. You're going to want to, uh, so say you have a pastebin, uh, or, uh, so like say here, I'll use an example for my YouTube. We'll go YouTube. We're going to go your channel. We're going to go, uh, funky Friday script, pastebin, pastebin.com. You're going to want to copy all this, click control C, close that, close that. Open kernel, open Roblox. Now, you're going to paste that. That's your script, okay? 
that is the list of commands that open this app that make you do whatever you want to do. I'm going to click execute. Do not hit anything else. Hit execute. It opens your thing. Now you're going to wait. So this one especially you just need to load. And once it's executed, here's your script. Uh, this also goes kind of like invisible or transparent, you could say. It makes it a lot simpler if you have one monitor. You can also minimize it. But it's just self-explanatory. It executes a script. You can use that. I'm just going to click the auto player. Use it as much as you wish. Uh, we'll do Zardy uh, Foolhardy. Okay, we're going to do Foolhardy. Let's start this start real quick. As you can see, it's playing. I don't know if this patch. No, it's not. Okay. It's auto playing. I can just I can go type in chat, so you know it's not me playing. So da 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 da. Still typing and it's playing. So you know that scripts work. So this script works. Now, say you don't want to find this script again and you're really enjoying it. This is where the open and save file comes in. Say I want to save this. This is what you're going to want. I'm going to name this Funky Friday, because that's the game. No, oh, well, that's Fur Day. Oops. Friday. Uh, since I already have one, I'm going to replace it, but it's always going to be an LUA. So that's how you know. I'm just going to replace it. Uh, from here, you can either clear it and use another script. Clear. Or you can add a script. So you can run two scripts at a time. You don't have to worry. So say you have... Uh, in the hood, people like to use Ray Code X, which is one script, and Swag Mode, which is another script. You can do that with Kernel. Uh, I know a lot of other ones you can't do as well. It's all basically the same thing. Um, from here, there's also options. This will just tell you... Uh, so, auto-attach. It means that once you're in a game, it's automatically going to attach. Uh, opacity fade-in. Uh, basically, it just... The fade-in. Uh, remove crash logs. Uh, I, nothing you really need. You don't need to touch anything. And that's basically it. It's just as simple as that. I will have the kernel download. I will have um, the Discord, actually, because kernel has a Discord. So if I go Discord, I'm going to open my Discord. Uh, shit. Uh, a lot of DMs and shit. Kernel. It'll tell you. It's always going to tell you. Common fixes, downloaded key. It's going to tell you it's working. Here are the websites. We are devs. Never get we are devs. Personally, it's just bad. It's going to have viruses. It's very bad. It, you don't want that. You only want the bootstrapper and the key. If you need the key, it's going to automatically bring you. I can't really show you right now. There's really nothing I can do about it. This is the key. I can't. Ooh. Yeah. yeah, we can be friends, bro. We're going to be we're gonna be best friends. All right. Uh, that's basically it. I'll have the kernel uh, discord uh, invite link, and I will have the kernel download for kernel.ca. So... Again, kernel.ca. You should call it school download. It's just as simple as that. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. And I hope this really helped you out with you guys who want to adventure into the, you know, world of exploiting. Um, goodbye. Hope you guys have a great day. And peace.